separating immiscible liquids is very easy. Just let the mixture settle down and take out the two liquids one by one. But what would you do if you need to separate two miscible liquids? Since the two liquids are mixed up, it is not going to be simple as the previous case. Today we shall study simple distillation, a method to separate a mixture of two miscible liquids, say aceton and water in our virtual lab. To begin with, a round bottom flask is filled with a mixture of aceton and water. This flask is known as a boiling flask. Add some porous pot chips into the flask. Position a hot plate underneath. Now connect a distilling head to the RB flask. Subjoin a thermometer to one end and a condenser tube to the other end of the distilling head. The condenser tube has an inlet that lets cold water in and an outlet from which this water escapes. Join the other end of the condenser to a vacuum adopter. Now attach another RB flask called the receiving flask to the other end of the vacuum adopter. Now that we have assembled the apparatus for simple distillation, let us start the process. Turn on the hot plate. The mixture of the two immiscible liquid gets heated and the thermometer records a rise in temperature. After some time, acetone begins to boil and changes into its vapors, while water remains unaffected as it has a higher boiling point. Till all the acetone vaporizes, the temperature remains constant at 56 degrees centigrade. The vapor of acetone enters the inner tube of the condenser where it slowly cools and condenses back into droplets of acetone. This acetone is then collected in the receiving flask. When almost all of the acetone has been collected in the receiver, switch off the heater. The liquid which remains in the boiling flask is actually the water which has a higher boiling point than acetone. In general, simple distillation is the process of separating the components of any homogeneous mixture such as that of acetone and water. The component with the lower boiling point vaporizes and gets condensed while the one with the higher boiling point is left behind. Let us summarize. Simple distillation is the process of separating the components of any homogeneous mixture such as that of acetone and water. The component with the lower boiling point evaporates out and gets condensed while the one with the higher boiling point is left behind. Fractional distillation may appear a bit complex compared to the technique of simple distillation, but fractional distillation has its own advantages. Stay tuned to learn more about fractional distillation in the upcoming videos. Keep imbibing. We believe in you.